Well, hey everyone, how's it going? Um, got something kind of unusual here. Of course, looking at this, not really unusual. It is an older 3000 watt unit, manufactured, I believe, in 2015, 2016, somewhere around there. I haven't looked at the build sticker yet. But what makes this unusual, the fact that it's 3000 watts and it's 24 volts. Now, PowerJack currently doesn't make any 24 volt 3000 watt inverters. They used to, obviously, but what makes it even more unusual, it is a split phase inverter. And I verified this. This is an actual split phase inverter. It's 3000 watts split phase. So I'm not sure why they quit making these. Number one, I get asked about 24 volt inverters going all the way down to 1500 watts. Number two, split phase um, inverters, this would be great for emergency backup, you know, critical loads, things that, you know, you've got a breakout box that you want powered um, separately from the panel, and you'd be able to power, you know, just have this inverter hooked up to a battery bank and connected right into the breaker panel, um, you know, a small breaker panel. Um, so that's, uh, you know, that would be the use here. Now, the smallest I've ever seen is actually a 5,000 watt unit in split phase and I actually bought one way back in like 2015 um, it was my first real power jack inverter but uh, I've never seen one of these things and when I saw it on the build sheet I thought it was a mistake um, and I haven't yet contacted power jack about it because they're all sleeping kinda wanted to find out any details on it but yeah it is a 3000 watt inverter and you wouldn't know that it was a split phase until you looked around front and I saw this, I thought this was a customer modification, but sure enough, reading the label, it is an actual split phase uh, inverter. The transformer is smaller than a 5 kilowatt um, inverter that you would see built today. There's no doubt about that. And this is a classic board. It's kind of a uh, all-in-one board. The whole thing would have to be replaced if your power source board were to go out or low-frequency driver. You know, the low-frequency driver is one of the few things that can be replaced that's modular. So, yeah, this is a real unusual thing. I don't know how much you could get out of this thing as far as power. You know, I would say probably no more than 2,000 watts, maybe 2,500 if you're lucky. You know, it's got a small fan on the back here. It's an interesting piece. Of course, there's spider webs and stuff in here that I gotta clean out. Um, there's no telling what all is crawled into here. But uh, yeah, it's an interesting uh, inverter. Uh, it's compact. You know, it'd be great for uh, you know some kind of RV or or something like that or something small that you would want to power a breaker panel with. It doesn't have any charging features or functions or anything else like that has two plugs and it's one of the strong ones um, so yeah it's got the aluminum chassis unusual um, but kinda cool to see something older like this um, in a split phase inverter 24 volts so yeah uh, pretty cool but anyway I just wanted to show you guys this cuz I come across some weird stuff once in a while that I uh, get and um, yeah, pretty cool. Um, uh, before I head out, of course, GenitreeSolar.com is uh, where the website is where you can inquire about getting not only this inverter, but any other inverter that has gone through here. Um, and uh, I want to thank some of you out there have actually been sending me free inverters um, to have to for parts or to modify or whatever else like that. Some of you just don't want to, you know, mess with them. Maybe you've got some older inverters like this and you're just like, you know what, I'm not doing anything with it. Might as well take it. I appreciate that. Um, that kind of, that really helps me out too, um, where I can, you know, get some parts out of them. And some of them can be repaired, some not. Some are too far gone to do anything with, but I can use some of the parts and things like that. So... Uh, yeah, pretty cool of you guys to do that. I appreciate that a lot. And as, as I, obviously, I appreciate your support as well. Doing the best I can here. And uh, anybody who orders from that GenitreeSolar.com website, that's uh, super helpful for me. Let's the guys at PowerJack know that I'm actually um, 
you know, out there helping everybody. So, all right. Uh, of course, if you have any questions, let me know. Take care.